all you got, come get the album, it's weird. So, I, I don't play the blues, so uh, there's a lot of other people that do a really good job at that, and I, I definitely recommend them. So, but if you're looking for weird stuff, and kind of pushing the envelope on some stuff, that, that's that CD right there, and it's hidden right behind that piece of wood there, so I promise there's CDs there. So uh, Rob researched and then found out that these uh, these roller balls are a, a better a better uh, alternative to someone who plays like me just kind of slapping around. So um, also you know this bass pickup. If I turn off my guitar. Lower end down there, 
So um, it's a it's a big 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 difference, and it really uh, broadens out the spectrum of your cigar box guitar. Uh, I also brought a limited number of those. Uh, ben Baker's got them. Uh, if he's around later, uh, if you're interested in these single coil pickups, uh, let him know they're for sale. Uh, it took me about really about four years of research. Uh, I saw John Lowe was doing something like that. We never dissected one of his guitars, but the little, to do them in a sewing bobbin, basically to wrap your own pickup in a sewing bobbin, it's been going on since the 40s and the 50s. They were actually wrapping sewing bobbins back then for uh, guitars. So um, I don't think anybody knows who really started it, but the, it's really in the application. I don't, I don't need three. I like piezos because they pick up all the little drummings and nuances, uh, the scratching on the box and stuff like that. You can, you can use to your advantage. Um, I guess I should have prefaced that with, uh, well, always wanted to be a drummer. So, and they just kept giving me guitars. So I just played drums on guitars. So, but, um, but yeah, they're, they're really neat. And like I said, they add a whole nother spectrum to the guitar and they, uh, they can be retrofit to anything you've already built. So it's not like you have to build a whole new guitar around these things. The same hole you drill for this nickel, the input actually goes right through too. So if you're, if you're good with needle nose, you can probably pull it out the other end there and tighten on. Nobody done that before? Where your nut falls off your jack there and you're like reaching in with needle nose pulled? Oh. Okay. All right, so anyway, one year ago, Rob let me try one.